Hello everyone, today I'm going to show you about spinal cord epony MoMA imaging. Demnology. It is a condition of spinal cord neoplasm arising from epony cells. Presentation next of vacuum progressive paraparesis. Uh, delay in diagnosis is due to slow growth. Average duration of symptoms before diagnosis 2.5 years. Age more common in adults 35 to 45 years. Six intramedular child may predominant, intradural, extramedullary, he may predominant. SNCCT, no rational regulation. Epidemiology, second most common primary spinal cord tumor incident. Most common primary spinal cord tumor in adult. 30% of all epidemiomas are spinal. At least third of those with neurofibromatosis type 2 will eventually develop spinal cord epidemioma. Imaging heterogeneous intramedullary spinal cord mass, cervical thoracic lobe conus. Most are intramedullary, maxillary, papillary tumor are found at conus medullaris and arising from pilum terminal. Heterogeneous but mostly hyperintense on tissue. Heterogeneous and cysts are common. T2 um, in a 16 years old with two speaker of pain after minor trauma, so a compact hemorrhage mass at the base of the gauda akin, consistent with eventual histologic diagnosis of mixo-papillary epidemioma. T2 C, T1C plus FSML in a teenager with Neurofibromatosis Taiwan, so by love enhancing intramedullary mass confirmed to be epinemoma secret to any intramedullary cord tumor in neurofibromatosis type 2 is presumed to be an epinemoma, and they are diagnosis in at least third of those with neurofibromatosis. Just tie to This is T2 um, in a 13 years old, presenting with next back pain with, and subsequent gait abnormality, so a very fine extra petersuma at the cervical thoracic junction with internosis. T1, C plus FSMR in the same patient should reduce and heterogeneous enhancement of the tumor, which has an anaplastic epinemomas at surgery. Most spinal epinemomas are a good one. And two reasons. High L grade has seen in less than 10% of this. This is DWIs and T1 C plus RSM image in a 11 years old with neuropathologist type 2, so a small enhancing intramedullary lesion with issues and restriction in cervical cord. The pneumonia is the most common intramedullary cord lesion in neuropathologist type 2. Treatment prognosis of grade one and two tumor is largely depend on the extent of the resection. Cross total resection is more than 85% of case. Radiation for subtotal resection grade three or recurrent disease. Chemotherapy for frail surgery and radiotherapy. 
most city in a part five to ten years survival rate are critical to one hundred following combination of low surgery and possible degradation to the beach. Thank you.